I represent the President of the United States. He also has only the best interest of the American people. Therefore, he will make his decision based upon what is the best interest of the United States. But if, if, if this is part of what he's thinking, we should prepare ourselves. We should have a, a plan B, just in case. I believe that the President's decision is going to be based upon what's best for the economy and the safety and security of the American people and also making sure that our borders are open and, yep. and that, you know, being from Kentucky, Canada is our number one trade partner. So I have a real interest at making certain that this border that we see in Kentucky is very thin and becomes thinner. You know, there's are good sciences on both issues and I believe that we are committed to our environment. Obviously, there are a lot of people on this earth and that is going to be a result of, of some of the damages to the planet. Mm -hmm. But I know that the president and all of the cabinet has the best interest of what is good for the United States and what is good for our environment. Obviously, the approach is different. We've stayed in the Paris Agreement. The president has decided to pull out. How do you navigate that when there's such a different approach to fighting climate change? Well, I think that the approach may seem different, but we all have the same goal, and that is to better our environment and to maintain the environment. Therefore, I feel like our administration has been on top of this, regardless of whether or not they will be pulling out. So they, they can still fight climate change even if they're not part of the agreement? Absolutely. Yeah. Do you yourself believe in climate change? I believe there are sciences that are b both on both sides that are accurate. You believe that there's scientists that, that science that proves that there is man is not causing climate change? Well, I think that both sides have you know they have their own um, uh, results from their studies, and, and I appreciate and I respect both sides of the science.